You're listening to The Daily Nugget. It's dnugget.com for Sunday, April 7th. Okay, does anyone else have to do this where you get to a certain time of the year and it's the fourth month and you like you have to do it in your head like January, February, March, April. Does anyone else have to do that as an adult? Or is it just me? It's just, just you. you. Just you, man. <laughs> well, yep. thank you for... You feel seen and supported? Well, th- yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank you for supporting my alternative lifestyle. You're the only you. non-functioning <laughs> adult here. <laughs> <laughs> That's truer than you think. <laughs> I don't know how I got to 40 years old. Let's be honest. Mm. Me neither. I've seen you do some really dumb things. Well, thank you for Sam. Sam did prevent me uh, from accepting a cookie from a Hare Krishna on Hollywood Boulevard. Oh, my gosh. True story. Wow. They were dancing around that one for a future podcast. Okay. (laughs) I mean, we it, it was on a mission trip, so we can just talk about it now. Yeah, it's just Sunday. We were we were on a mission trip. In San Diego, and for our our for our fun day, we decided we didn't decide. Somebody else decided for us to go, that we were going to go to L.A. to, to L.A. and go to Hollywood. And so we didn't know what to do. So Andy, myself, and two uh, two other friends, one of whom Andy was holding hands with. Um, we're doing okay. Those. okay. That's another we're episode. Going, we're going there. Uh, okay. <laughs> It could have um, been one of hundreds of women. That I <laughs> yeah. um, and and the trip we're, walking around, we're walking around and like we were all hungry. So we found we found one of the uh, we found a pizza place that sold pizza by the slice. We were like, awesome. And so as we were walking in, there's a group of Hari Krishnas, which are essentially gypsies. Um, right. They dress up like. I don't know, like uh, Eastern. Yeah, kind of like Eastern folky. Yeah, like monkey-ish. And, monk, and they were monk-ish. That's what I mean, like, like a monk. <laughs> like monk They were dancing around and they were singing <laughs> and they were offering. It's like we don't know enough about this, but okay. Yeah. They were offering cookies. Yeah. And out of the four of us, three of us said, no, thank you. Andy, on the other hand. I can't. Food. And he said, "Yeah, I'll take a cookie." I can't turn Sounds down. Like I can't turn down sugar or treats. But we didn't know what was in that, but this and it was obviously hand sugar. wrapped. Uh, and none of them looked like they were completely lucid. Ew. So Ew. we got we walk into this pizza place, and Andy starts uncrumpling this plastic thing of cookies, and we're all like, "Dude, what are you doing?" He's like. I'm I'm hungry. <laughs> like we are getting pizza, which yeah. is right there. It's Delayed like, gratification. And I am trying to respect he, other cultures. <laughs> he looks so puzzled. What happened to equity? <laughs> we, and we and we go diversity and know, inclusion. You don't know if they put something in that. And right. his response was epic. He looked at the three of us. With the most innocent look on his face. And he goes, why would they do that? (laughs) Because, Andy, the three of us people in the world. (laughs) Then I said, I then I said, but that's illegal. (laughs) People don't do illegal things. (laughs) No, not in California. (laughs) we, We had to stop Andy from eating food that was possibly put had something in it listen when you're and going holding hands with girls when you're when you're go, when you're walking that weren't his wife in my defense and he's trying to change the subject now that we're here <laughs> in my defense hey when you're going into a store and if there's a random person in front of it selling you cookies they, those were not sold you take you buy them True. what's the difference What's the difference between the Hare Krishnas and Girl Scouts that well, you, you think are Girl Scouts? Up, so. One comes machine packaged and yeah. sealed, and the other comes from a girl with not all of her teeth. <laughs> wow. 
not even the marketing was good, huh? No. <laughs> he just went for it. <laughs> like they had a megaphone and they were dancing around. It was kind of fun. They were singing and they looked like they were having a good time. I thought Did you join them in I, their dance? I felt like I was in a Mentos commercial. They were all oh. eating the cookies, Andy. <laughs> they were all eating the cookies. <laughs> Everyone was That's dancing and having a good time. time. Don't you want to dance and have a good time? <laughs> and if they jumped off a cliff, what would you do? Well, well there were no there, cliffs. Are there but... cookies involved? <laughs> <laughs> Probably. <laughs> So I we have you were... giant slices of pizza that we're trying to eat, and Andy's too too busy with his Hari Krishna cookie. I couldn't share your pizza. gigantic slice of pizza that we've all been talking about. Hmm. What were you saying, Janelle? I said, okay, so it was between the cookie and the slice of pizza. Yes. What kind of cookie was it? Well, we we're not I think sure. There was an almond on it or something. That's not a good cookie. I've I've, I've remember little I've, I've, bits of oregano. I think it was a sugar-ish cookie, small, and it looked like there was an almond or something in the middle of it. I I kind of have this picture of it in my head still, even though it was tw- it look like twenty a years ago. You had had before. <laughs> no, I don't think so. But I was willing to try some. I was in California. <laughs> Things are new. If you were willing to try. <laughs> These kind strangers on the street gave it to me. <laughs> this toothless woman handed me a cookie. I wonder what's in it. Could be <laughs> sugar, or it could be meth. I'm, very, I'm pretty sure that was pre-meth. Well, maybe meth is around not, then. That's not okay. <laughs> I don't know, Andy. I guess I'm the glad ju- you have a handler I mean, with you at all times. I think so. Here. You really do. We're talking about the guy who ate wax by accident because it was colored pretty. Oh, yeah. He did some (laughs) other stuff, too. It was weird. I don't even know what you're talking about, Jen, but I really don't want you to talk about that, whatever it is. (laughs) Other weird... Just other things you ate that were okay. weird. That's what okay. I, yeah, I mean, you could have, <laughs> you know, <laughs> I don't know what you're you could about. have eaten that cookie and then you really would have seen that girl in heaven. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't your mother ever what teach you to not up? take cookies from strangers? Apparently Is that not. what I was supposed to learn from her? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I thought it was, maybe, I was supposed to. Maybe I should. Leave another message on your mom's Facebook page. Oh, no, please. Yeah. Is, oh, oh, no. Did you ever teach Andy to not take candy from strangers? <laughs> then I have to have a con. They do have a conversation with me, Sam, when you leave the messages like that. It oh, ends up coming back. Last time. How'd that go? Oh, <laughs> we were at the pizza buffet at Pizza Ranch of all places, which is supposed to be a place of joy and mirth. Yes. Because it has pizza there. and it has yeah. the word ranch in it. And they have, have something called there. this is a throwback. And they have something called what? cactus Wait, bread. No. Were there cookies or just talked pizza? about Andy's mom getting her tambourine stolen? Yes. Yeah. No, I diffused that pretty quickly because I said, I'm not sticking up for the guy who did it. I don't care. I'll throw him under the bus. I said, it was this guy. <laughs> and she goes, okay, that makes sense. And that was the end of the conversation. <laughs> Back to pizza. Right. Okay. So how bad could this be? Right. <laughs> I mean, it's a little worse, but how bad could it be? What well, could what be? Telling her about this that we've been discussing no. the cookie situation. That Andy <laughs> almost I don't, oh my gosh, I don't know. died I, of I, aren't you still consumption. Even as adults. Are you adults, being grounded still? I'm afraid at some point. Well, I don't know. Uh, it would be the reverse Hollywood. grounding. It would be uh, when I need them to watch my kids, they would force me to stay with them instead or something. I don't know. <laughs> Listen, I have a lot of childcare needs in the next few weeks. So please don't ruin it for me. Better start making and some cookies to, to bribe people with. And that's the nugget. I can't take any more blackmail. I can't. Oh, oh, you don't like being on the receiving end of all this? Interesting. <laughs> Interesting. Well, oh my, how the tables have turned. <laughs> all sad. <laughs> I got ChatGPT to make two very sweet poems about your birthday, Jen. It's true. You he got. He did that. 
a robot to make me something free. He, he did. So what did you do exactly? <laughs> I thought of it. It's the thought that counts. Somebody had to I type it into the website. I had to go to the thought, website. How can I do this with the least amount of effort? Right. <laughs> okay, next week I'll come up with a human made poem for you. No, my birth month is over. No, you missed it. We're in the birth year now. This is like no. Hootie Who plus two. It's going to be a year long. <laughs> yes, it's going to be a year long thing. At email.com if you have poems for Jen's birth. Every Saturday for the rest Why of 2024. Poems even. We, Every- did that. How- we, we, we will also that. we will also accept haikus and limericks. <laughs> we will not. Every Saturday for the rest of 2024, it'll be Jen's birthday plus whatever. Don't make more promises that you can't keep. No, we will keep this one. (laughs) So stupid. We will keep this one.